Welcome back, everybody. We are just a week away from Thanksgiving, and if you're still looking for the perfect side dish to bring to your feast, you're in luck. Angelique Lazardi is here with us, and this is something that you make. I love deviled eggs. They're so yes. good for you, so let's get started. I know. Good protein. They are my turkey day deviled egg delight is what I call them, but it's always nice to have a little treat before the main dish right and then you don't the stuff yourself right exactly so you stuff yourself on <laughs> <several> <laughs> eggs, right? and I tend to yeah. do that too but they're so good so what I do is I usually cook the eggs to about 20 minutes I know that's a little longer than usual but I just like to do that I think it hardens the egg and the yolk just comes out better to mix it okay so that's what I do first now we'll get you mixing this though Allison okay. so all those ingredients are there we mash up the egg yolk first is what I do. Okay, um, so it's already kind of mashed. It's already kind of mashed right? up. I add about a teaspoon or so of the relish first. Okay, got it. Um, but again, you can be pretty generous depending on how tasty you want this to be. And remember, okay. you don't need that much salt even though it's in the recipe because mayonnaise always tends to already have a lot of sodium in it. So mm -hmm. it already has a lot of and flavor. And I bet the, the relish has quite it a bit does of the mustard, too. everything. Right. So, right. you know, you can just add all those three ingredients, the mayo, the mustard, and the relish. And is it a teaspoon of each? Yes, about a teaspoon of each. I'm a little bit more generous when I make mine, so I probably add a little bit more. There we go. Um, I'll be generous too mayo. Then. Yes, I just think it tastes better. And why not? It's Thanksgiving, right? Yeah, I mean, you're <laughs> going to blow it anyway. Exactly. So we add pepper as well, some okay. garlic powder to the entire mix, and then you just mix it up. And this is so easy. This is what's so great about this recipe. It's quick. It's easy. You mix it all up. And then we have our hard-boiled egg that is already here um, that have not been dressed just yet. And then, of course, you have the pepper and paprika that you can add, of course, once you Everything. put the egg yolk yeah. in there, so Just I like little. it. But again, you can top it with a lot of different things. You know, you don't have to use relish. I know a lot of people aren't, you know, fans of that. And this is dill relish. This Which is not I sweet like relish, yeah. right? The dill makes all the difference. So once you mash it up, and it's and it doesn't take long at all. The preparation Ooh, is golly. quick. So you get. Up, over, I'm using a teaspoon type of spoon because this actually helps put. The oh, portion size. See how easy that is? Yeah, I mean, it's just I, a little scoop and oh, you're ready to go. I have big scoops. You want to try one of these, Matt? Here, or do you want to try one? Try, try. <laughs> <laughs> Matt broke. I like the finished product better. <laughs> Allison, you're doing a great job too. Listen, just remember who you work with for an hour every day. <laughs> yeah, <right? laughs> but they're delicious, guys. Quick Ooh, to yeah, make, good. and mm. also it's great protein. They're pretty. They're a healthy snack too. So I like the dill tasty. in there too. It isn't mm -hmm. the dill nice? If you want the zone. recipe yeah. for these eggs, you can find them on our website, kvoa.com. We'll be right back. I'll have another one. 